Helping tonight, a controversial captain now off the force. Miami police firing 18-year veteran Javier Ortiz. Local 10's Christian De La Rosa live now with what led up to his termination. Christian. Well, the police chief says he is weeding out a bad apple, but this now former cop's attorney says she believes his termination is politically motivated. I'm a black male. Yes, I am. He might be Miami's most controversial cop. And now the police chief is giving him the boot. He lacks good moral character. Javier Ortiz's termination letter accuses him of improperly approving overtime for officers under his command. A panel initially recommended he be fired over the issue, but another board later exonerated him. Chief Manuel Morales says he had the final say Tuesday. It was part of the totality of, of, of the evidence that I looked at. The now former police captain has made headlines before. I'm a black male. Once for marking himself yes, as black for promotional advantage at the department. One woman sought a restraining order against him, accusing Ortiz of harassing her on social media in retaliation over her complaint against the county cop for speeding. Then there was the time he tried to start a boycott against Beyonce for a video addressing police shootings. Documents obtained by local 10 News show Ortiz has dozens upon dozens of complaints against him, dating back to the early 2000s. He's been relieved of duty multiple times. Rodney Jacobs is interim executive director of the Civilian Investigative Panel. And I think at least as it relates to the community, it's almost a sigh of relief that something has finally been done. Those investigations and those allegations were not sustained. Ortiz's attorney, Griska Mena, says the veteran cops firing is shocking and unwarranted. As to the allegations here, he was following a directive by the chief of police at that time. So if there's no evidence according to you, what is the motive? There are political motivations. The attorney wouldn't go into detail as to why she believes this termination may be politically motivated. As she said, she does stress Ortiz will appeal. Live in Miami, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News.